Modes of Nutrition The whole process by which an organism takes in nutrients and utilizes it for growth, development and maintenance is called nutrition. Consequently, the method by which an organism procures food is called mode of nutrition. The two main modes of nutrition are autotrophic and heterotrophic. Autotrophs are self-nourishing. Green plants, the biggest chemical factories, are the best example. These plants trap solar energy and manufacture their food in the form of simple sugars from inorganic compounds like carbon dioxide and water. This process is known as photosynthesis. Since they convert radiant energy into chemical energy, they are photoautotrophic. Heterotrophic nutrition. This mode of nutrition is characteristic of man, all animals, fungi, certain bacteria and insectivorous plants. Heterotrophs depend directly or indirectly upon autotrophs. Heterotrophic mode of nutrition is of three main types. Holozoic, saprophytic, parasitic. Autotrophs are self-nourishing. Green plants, the biggest chemical factories, are the best example. These plants trap solar energy and manufacture their food in the form of simple sugars from inorganic compounds like carbon dioxide and water. This process is known as photosynthesis. Since they convert radiant energy into chemical energy, they are photoautotrophic. Green sulfur bacteria, purple sulfur bacteria, non-sulfur purple bacteria are other examples of photoautotrophs. In these bacteria, the reducing power comes from the hydrogen sulfide and not water. Chemoautotrophs. The organisms, as the name suggests, do not require light. They manufacture their food from inorganic substances in the presence of energy derived from oxidation of simple inorganic compounds of iron, sulfur, etc. Example, Nitrosomonas bacteria. Heterotrophic nutrition. This mode of nutrition is characteristic of man, all animals, fungi, certain bacteria and insectivorous plants. Heterotrophs depend directly or indirectly upon autotrophs. Heterotrophic mode of nutrition is of three main types. Holozoic, saprophytic, parasitic. Holozoic nutrition means taking in of solid complex food and breaking it into simpler form. This type of nutrition preferably involves a specialized digestive tract called the alimentary canal. Example, mammals. It involves stages like ingestion, taking in food through mouth, digestion, change of complex food into simple soluble form with the help of enzymes, absorption, passing of simple soluble nutrients into the blood, assimilation, Utilization of absorbed food. Egestion. Expelling undigested food. Saprophytic nutrition. In this form of nutrition, organisms obtain their food from dead and decaying organic matter of plants and animals. Some examples are fungi like rhizopus and mushroom, bacteria like monotropa, Indian pipe plate. These organisms release some enzymes to digest the dead organic matter which is then absorbed through the body surface. Parasitic nutrition. The organism here derives its food from another living organism called the host. 
a parasite is dependent either wholly or partially on the host for nutrition. The host generally suffers in the process. Some examples are Cascuta, a total stem parasite, Balanophora, a total root parasite, Wiscum, partial stem parasite, Santalum album or sandal, a partial root parasite, Plasmodium, a protozoan which causes malaria, roundworms, etc. Other interesting forms of nutrition are Mixotrophic heterotrophs, which have more than one type of nutrition. Example, euglena.